Samira Garcia was shot 10 times in South Philadelphia last week. Two SEPTA police officers who were patrolling nearby heard that gunfire, chased the gunman and shot him several times. He's now recovering in police custody. And tonight, family and friends held a vigil for the victim. They also hoped to raise awareness about domestic violence. NBC 10's Leah Uko has the story. There's no more separation where all tears will be wiped from our mind. Samira Garcia's absence. It left this crowd in South Philly feeling bitter on this Monday night. Everybody knows that she didn't deserve this. They held a candlelight vigil outside the Target on Broad in Washington because it's where the 20 year old worked, but also where the district attorney's office says she was on her way to when her ex-boyfriend gunned her down. Our partners at KYW reported Garcia had just filed a protection from abuse order hours before the shooting. That morning, she was, the, Kate said the she was the happiest. The police wouldn't come get the restraining order on Sunday when he tried to break into our house and broke down our door <laughs> and went into our neighbor's house. Family, friends, and coworkers out tonight, they encourage people to speak up if they see, experience, or commit any act of domestic violence. I don't care how long it's been with you, your family, and nothing, just speak out. Someone's always going to be there to help. Women Against Abuse reported of the 562 homicides in Philadelphia last year, 43 were domestic assault related. Some city council members and police officers told our partners at KYW this is a significant increase in comparison to other years, and it's partly caused by the pandemic where more people found themselves without jobs, housing, or food. None of these reasons help this community make any sense of how Garcia's young life ended so soon. It's going to miss her face, her smile, her voice. It's going to miss her everything about my baby. From South Philly, Leah Uko. NBC 10 News. If you or anyone you know may need help, call the National Domestic Violence Hotline at 1-800-273-8255.